Hello friends, welcome back to the new tutorial of the Nest.js. Currently, I am facing one of the issue that is error service account object must contain a string project ID property. So basically the issue is because of the Firebase credentials are not set. And I will check, I will show you what exactly the issue is. So here we have the code level. Okay, so here it, previously it was like this. So type project ID, private key ID. So where we get all these credentials, right? So we have the service account.json file where we have to get all of details. Okay. So here now I have just filled out all the details over here, right? Auth URI, token URI and all. I'm saving this one. Okay. And just restart it. Let's start. And here you can see that there is no error. So this is how you are able to fix that issue very easily. So any doubt, any query in that, you will just let me know in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching this video. Don't forget to like, share and comment on my video if you like it because it's solving the one of the issue that is service account object. And the one thing, sometimes you say, uh, asking me like in the comment section, I will let you know about this one also, like where you get these details. Like... Uh, Normally, if I go and just check out like uh, type is where we are getting project ID, private key ID, where I get all of this stuff, right? So previously when we do the Firebase part, what we will do, this is for the Firebase admin, okay? So the, where you get all these details, you have to go to our uh, Firebase account, right? And here we have the service accounts, okay? So you have to go to the service accounts into your Firebase account systems. So project settings. Okay. So here we have a service accounts. Okay. So here you can see that you have to create this service account. Here you can see that if you, if you go and just down, you, you can see that I have just created the new generate private key service account. It will download you the service account file like this one. Okay. Like this, I have downloaded this one. Okay. Firebase admin SDK. Okay, so it will give me the all the details of that one here. You can get all the details and just put it over here in your Nest.js application and it will solve the issue. Any doubt, any query in that, just let me know in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching this video. Have a great day.